welcome to part four of my mining series. I'm going to take you guys through how to download and set up uh, Claymore Zcash Miner today. So what we're going to do is I'll have these links in my um, description below. But generally I use the Mega Link um, because the Google Link is normally um, over bandwidth and it doesn't let you download it. So if you just uh, go to the Mega Link. And he's up to version 6.0 at the moment. So if you just double click on that file, it'll take a couple of minutes and it'll download to your downloads folder. So I've already downloaded it. So I'm just going to show you guys. Um, it'll come in a zip folder. Open the zip folder. Just copy this. And just paste it to your desktop or wherever you want it to go. Now, with the Zcash miner, guys, once you go into it, um, I'll put my... Um, command line in there as well because it's slightly different from the default one. Uh, the main difference with mine is uh, there's an intensity setting now. So what happens is this is this is basically the default line which is in his miner so I'm just mining to Flyfall still. Uh, you put your wallet in here so you can create a uh, free account on Polonia because that's where I mine straight to because I sell the coins straight away. And then uh, the dot and whatever you want your rig to be called. So if you've got multiple rigs, just give them a different name so you can track which ones uh, are running correctly and which ones aren't. And then the, uh, the dash I, so you've got three intensity levels. You've got zero, one, and two. So two is the most intensive, so I'm running two. Uh, this setting here is for the um, GPU core clock. Um, uh, memory, sorry, not the memory, the, uh, the power usage, so 910 millivolts. And this is for the memory. So in here, what happens is when I run this, it actually sets these two fields here to 910 power instead of the default, which is a thousand. So the good thing about having that in your actual command line is, uh, if your if your rig crashes and you need to restart your rig or something, or you or your driver uh, fails, sometimes what will happen is this will default back to um, your default power settings, which are a thousand. And then when you go to run them again, they'll just be using a lot more power than what they should be using. So by having this in your command line, you avoid that completely altogether. Now, I've just done some mining before. I'm not going to start it up on the video. Um, I will start it up on the video, actually. So this is 6.0. It's not going to run at uh, full capacity, obviously, because we're doing a video. Um, but this is uh, mining from just before. So we're getting between 135 and 140 hertz. Per, uh, per card, so this uh, test rig's got four cards in it, and uh, we're using the Claymore 6.0 minor version, which is current up to date. Now, by using those same links, guys, when he releases new versions, you can just download the new version. You can copy, go in here, you can copy your start file into the new folder, and away you go. So this is the uh, this is the minor happening now. So this GPU three is obviously controlling our um, our video at the moment. And it's obviously using a little bit more. It'll take a minute or two for it to pick up uh, to the correct speed. But yeah, if you're doing a raid on RX40, you should get around these hash rates. So that's it, guys. Thanks for uh, thanks for tuning into part four, and I'll see you guys next time.